Defend News Watch 16 at 7 tonight with a story on our area's extreme weather. Tonight, we open the video vault for a story about a weather system that was deadly. Folks in Wyoming County will never forget the summer of 1998 when a tornado swept through Lake Cary. News Watch 16 was back in Lake Cary one year after the deadly twister. June 2nd, 1998 was a day very similar to this one. Sunny skies, warm and a bit humid with a threat of thunderstorms in the forecast. Beautiful. Not a cloud in the sky. The storms didn't roll in until after 9. Less than an hour later, this peaceful community was in shambles. Yeah, I thought that I, would, I was going to die and I was so grateful that I wasn't. When I looked out the window, I thought that everybody else was. The powerful tornado took just 45 seconds to plow through. Century-old trees were ripped from the ground, landing on homes and cars. Ann Wallant was sitting at her kitchen table when the roof was literally ripped from her home. Well, I didn't think it was that bad mm -hmm. until this thing started to fly. Yeah. <laughs> and that was hell. Anne is one of the lucky ones. She escaped unharmed, and her home has since been rebuilt. Across the lake, Buck Ferguson laid trapped in his basement with his dog, Sweetie Face, by his side. It took a heroic rescue from neighbors to save his life. Now, Buck remembers June 2nd with the remnants of his old grandfather clock, now framed on his rebuilt living room wall. Three minutes after 10 is when this went off. Buck also remembers that day every time it rains. When he hears thunder, he heads for the basement. That's your lucky corner? Yes. Yes, very lucky. Scott Schaefer, Newswatch 16, Lake Cary.